What's going on everybody? I'm back with another High Risk Coin Busher video for you all today. And in today's video we're going to be doing a $30 million buy-in that gave us 100 quarters. Super, super expensive game today. Anyhow, wish me good luck. Hopefully we can win the jackpot. My goodness, they got this thing stacked up pretty good. Looks like the world's biggest wall of chips in there. They got two layers of $5,000 chips and a layer of $10,000 chips right there in the center. There's all kinds of $1,000 and $25,000 chip towers back there on the pusher. They got all kinds of gold in there and a gigantic brown mystery bag way back there. So we definitely have the potential to make some big money today, that's for sure. There's a boatload of quarters in there today also. Anyhow, speaking of the quarters, that was the last of them, so let me go see what I've won real quick, and we'll get right back to pushing. Oh yeah, nice. Check that out. So we got about 300 quarters now. She's doing incredible today. About to get some of those $1,000 and $25,000 chip towers to go. Oh nice, we just got one of them. And check that out, the base of that wall, it's sliding out. That wall will probably crash down within the next couple of minutes, hopefully. Come on, bring me the money. Nice, we're getting a boatload of quarters back. That's always a good thing. Oh yeah, that wall, it's about to go. Come on, give me something. Oh yeah, look at all those $10,000 chips up front. Once those slide out from underneath that wall, the whole thing is just going to crash down. It's probably going to fall backwards. That's the direction it's leaning. About to start getting a bunch of $10,000 chips. Oh yeah, nice. Starting to make some big money now. Well, that right there was the last of our quarters, so... Let me go collect the quarters real quick, and we'll get right back to pushing. The AMV coin busher has her turn. Let's keep it going. Nice, we got that humongous wall to crash down. Oh my goodness, nice. Look at all those $10,000 chips. $5,000 chips. We're making a fortune today. Come on. Oh my goodness, it's waterfall after waterfall. Definitely making it rain today, that's for sure. My goodness, that's millions of dollars worth of five and ten thousand dollar chips in there for sure. Oh yeah, well that loot shoot's getting pretty piled up, so let's try to get it cleared out real quick. Yeah, it's not good to let that loot shoot get too full. Because a lot of times, money will start to fall back to the house. We don't want that to happen. All right, there we go. We got it all cleared out of there. And check this out. We got that gigantic brown mystery bag. So this feels extremely heavy. So I will open this up after we win all those remaining chips out of there. So anyhow, let's get right back to pushing. Well, let me collect some quarters real quick. I'll be right back. Alrighty, a and coin pusher has returned. Let's keep it pushing. So we made a tremendous amount of money on that last round. We made millions of dollars so far. And we got a truckload of gold and a boatload of quarters. So let's keep it going. Let's try to get all those remaining chips out of there. And like I said earlier, after we win all those remaining chips and gold, I will open up that brown mystery bag. Feels like it has a lot of good stuff in there. Hopefully some dice. Those dice are very valuable. So anyhow, I hope y'all are doing good and having an amazing day so far. Remember, if you're new around here and you enjoy the videos, do me a favor. Hit that like button, subscribe, turn on the post bell notifications. That way you get notified for whenever I upload a new video. 
would help out a lot. We're on the road to 115,000 subscribers. My goal is to get there by June the 15th, so hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. And also, let's try to get 5,000 likes on today's video. 5,000 likes. I know we can do that. I just need all y'all watching to hit that like button. And also, I forgot to mention, it is 100% free to like, comment, and subscribe. I mean, I don't get paid for y'all hitting that subscribe button or hitting that like button. I mean, in reality, it just makes it a million percent easier for you all to keep up with future videos. Because once you hit that subscribe button, there should be a bell icon right next to it. And if you hit that bell icon, it will give you the option to turn on all notifications. And if you do that, you will get notifications on your phone, TV, laptop, computer, whatever you watch my videos on. You will get notifications every single time I post a brand new video. So like I said, it really just makes it a lot easier for you all to keep up with the future videos. And I pretty much post seven days a week, so if you want to see more amazing videos like this one, I would highly suggest hitting that subscribe button. Alrighty, AMV Coin Pusher has returned. Let's keep it going. So let's try to win all those remaining chips out of there. Anyhow, we made a tremendous amount of money on that last round. Got a bunch more gold, got a ton of quarters. Overall, it's been a brilliant game so far. So I think our best bet is to play on that right side for now. Try to get that last 10 grand, then we'll switch over to that left side. Oh yeah, that 10 grand on the right corner, it's moving forward a little bit. Anyhow, there's three ways we could win all those towers and chips that are on the blue shelves today. The first way we could stack the quarters up real high back there on the pusher. If we stack them up really high, we have a good chance of trick shotting one of the towers into the play field. But as you can see, none of the towers, none of those thousand dollar chip towers are near the pusher. So I don't think that first method would work out today. Anyhow, the second way we can win them towers is if they have a $5 chip hidden in there. And if we win that $5 chip, we get to cash it in. They will move all those towers that are on the blue shelves to the play field for free. Anyhow, if that $5 chip is not in there today, this is the third way we could win them towers. I would have to pay five times the original buy-in. And they would move all them towers that are on the blue shelves to the play field. I don't think that would be worth it today, so let's just hope that that $5 chip is hidden inside that mystery bag. Anyhow, that right there was the last of our quarters. Let me go collect some quarters and we'll get those remaining chips out of there. I'll be right back. Alrighty, I'm back. Let's keep it pushing. So let's try to push on that left-hand side. I think that's our best bet for now. Oh, nice. Just got like, I think that was seven grand. I'm pretty sure. About to get another $5,000 chip on that corner. And also, if you don't know this, anything that falls down those side slots, there's one on the left and the right side, that money goes to the house. I don't get a win or keep any of that money. I only get a win and keep whatever falls off the front ledge there. But anyhow, sometimes there's a $50 chip in there. And if we win that $50 chip, we get to cash it in. They will take anything that's falling down those side slots and move it back to the play field. I don't get to pick where they move, whatever we've lost, but um, all I know is they'll put it in there somewhere. Pretty much give us a second chance at winning it. And anyhow, most of the time they will build it into a whole new tower, whatever we've lost. They would either put it back there on the pusher or somewhere on the playing field. Anyhow, we just got that $5,000 chip that was hanging off the edge on the left corner. That one right there is getting pretty close also. Still getting a boatload of quarters to fall down. Quarters are definitely the most important thing in the game. Because without the quarters, you can't win any of the chips. Well, I guess you can also call the quarters ammo. That's pretty much what it is. 
Come on, big money, give me something. Oh yeah, it's getting super, super close. Yeah, we just need a big push on that left-hand side. All right, well that right there was the last of the quarters. So let me collect some quarters and we'll get that remaining $5,000 chip out of there. I'll be right back. Alrighty, I'm back, let's keep it pushing. So let's get that remaining $5,000 chip out of there. And after that, I will open up that gigantic brown mystery bag. Oh yeah, it's on the move. It's hanging about a quarter of the way off the edge now. All right, now it's about halfway. Another push or two and we'll get it, definitely. Come on, big money. Well, that one didn't move it at all. Let's see if that does it. That's super, super close. It's like right there on the edge. Now let's just continue pushing on that left hand side. Seems to be working pretty well. Oh yeah, this moved again, so it's hanging about three-fourths of the way off the edge. I don't think it's going to take much more. Alright, just move forward a little bit more right there. My goodness, how much closer is it going to get? It's insane. Now we're already almost out of quarters. Nice, we got it, got it all cleared out of there. That is absolutely spectacular. So now let's go ahead and open up that brown mystery bag. All right, here it is. Let's open it up and see if there's anything good and valuable in there. Feels extremely heavy. Let's see, what we get? Oh yeah, nice, check this out. We got a bunch of stuff. There's still some more stuff in there. I'll get that out here in just a second. Anyway, let's see what we got so far. We got this red earbud. I haven't seen a red earbud in there before. So I will ask them if this means anything. Who knows, this might be a $100 million win right here. You never know. So I will ask them about that here in just a second. Anyhow, we got three $10,000 chips. So that's $30,000. I'll take it. And we also got this $1 chip, so this right here is worth 500 quarters. I can cash this in, they'll give me an extra 500 quarters. And a lot of y'all was wondering if I could save these for a different game. No, I have to cash these in on the present game. We can't save these chips. Well, I just dropped it on the ground. I'll pick it up here in a second. Anyhow, we got a bunch of dice. Look at this. We got four gold dice and six white dice. So the white dice, we get to roll them at the end of the game, whatever they land on. My winnings will multiply by that amount. And the gold dice, we get to roll them at the end of the game, whatever they land on. The gold will multiply by that amount. So that is absolutely brilliant. We definitely have the potential to make some big money today, that's for sure. So anyhow, there's still a bunch more stuff in there. Let's see what we get. Oh yeah, nice. Check that out. So we got two bitcoins. These have no cash value. They're just entries into a free $100,000 buy-in giveaway. So that's not bad, not bad at all. I'll take it. And we got two more $10,000 chips. So I think that makes 50 grand that we got in $10,000 chips. That's pretty good. And we got another white dice. So that makes seven white dice we've won in total. That is amazing. And lastly, we got this $50 chip. So like I said earlier, we get to cash this in. They will take anything that we've lost to those side slots, put it back into the play field. So you know one thing I just noticed? We did not get that $5 chip that we get to cash in. However, we did win this red earbud. So I'm wondering if they replaced the $5 chip with a red earbud. So I'll tell you what, let me go ask them real quick and I'll let y'all know what they say. All right, I'm back. So I asked them about this red earbud. Turns out this means the exact same thing as that $5 chip. So we get to cash this in. They will move all those towers and chips that we lost to the play field. That is absolutely incredible. I was worried for a little bit, that $5 chip not being in there. Anyhow, this works out pretty good. So I'm gonna go ahead and cash this in and this $1 chip. They will give me an extra 500 quarters and they will move all them towers and chips to the play field. I'll be right back. 
Alrighty, Andy Coinbuster has returned. Let's keep it pushing. So I cashed in that earbud and that $1 chip. They moved all those towers that was on the blue shelves to the play field. And they gave me an extra 500 quarters. So wish me good luck. Hopefully we can get it all cleared out of there now. So it looks like they can bond most of those towers into like one enormous tower back there on the pusher. Oh my goodness. Well, we lost like $4,000 to the blue shelf. So it would cost us a hundred grand to get that back. Don't know if that'd be worth it or not. Oh yeah, tower back there on the pusher. It's about to go any moment now. Nice, we got it. And that completely demolished both of those gold towers that was up front. That is incredible. So the gold bars, they're worth whatever one ounce of gold is at the moment. I think they're around like $1,950 a piece right now. That's a spot price anyhow. They were around like $2,000 last week. But I think they're starting to go back down a little bit, unfortunately. Yeah, I try to save as much gold as I can. Already got a boatload of them saved up. Anyhow, if you're wondering why they did not move those chips that are against the walls to the play field whenever I cashed in that red earbud, it's because those chips are for decoration only. The only way we could win those is if we trick shot them into the play field using the quarters. And if you've seen previous videos, y'all know that that is extremely difficult to do. I've only been able to do it like three or four times out of thousands of games. So it's pretty rare for that to happen. And if we were to trick shot those chips into the play field and win them, they would count those as a win, whatever the cash value of the chips are. But on the other hand, if we were to trick shot those tiny dice that are on top of those chips into the play field and we win those, I would have to give those back to them because those aren't the dice that we get a roll at the end of the game. Those have no value at all. Anyhow, that right there was the last of our quarters, and goodness gracious, we already just about got it all cleared out of there. That is amazing. Well, let me go collect some quarters real quick, and we'll get right back to pushing. Alrighty, a and coin pusher has returned. Let's keep it pushing. So let's win all those remaining chips out of there, and I think I might pay that extra 100 grand to get them to move those chips that we lost back to the play field. Because we did win nine of the, or no, seven of the white dice. And those multiply our winnings. Say if all of them combined end up multiplying my winnings by 30. 30 times, what is that, $6,000? You do the math, that'd be a little over 100 grand. Actually, it might be way over 100 grand. So anyhow, we're about to get that two grand on the left-hand side. But I think we should focus on that right side. Because that's where most of the money's at. That last thousand dollar chip on the left will probably fall out of there on its own. That's just extremely difficult to get the quarters to go over there on that right side. Same thing for the left. See how they'll roll to the center or the opposite side? Come on, big money. Oh yeah, that three grand right there, it's about to go. Well, we're almost out of quarters once again, so let me go collect the quarters. We'll get right back to pushing. Alright, I'm back. Let's keep it pushing. Oh, nice. We got that last three grand. Now let's get that last thousand dollars. Oh, yeah. It's almost there. Come on, big money. Give me something. Alright, 
out I'm back so for whatever reason my camera cut out on me and it didn't get that last thousand dollars falling and me cashing in that fifty dollar chip so unfortunately I didn't get any of that on camera but anyhow let's go ahead and roll them dice on down to the lower shelf hopefully they land on some huge numbers yeah I don't know what's causing my camera to cut off like that Anyhow, we got a four and a six so far, so that's, let's see, ten times our winnings. Yeah, that got me all messed up whenever the camera cut out on me like that. Anyhow, those are some pretty good numbers. I'm going to count everything up, multiply our winnings and our gold by that, and I'll let y'all know what we've won back from a $30 million buy-in. I'll be right back. You all are not going to believe how much money I've won today. This is absolutely phenomenal. I ended up winning $7,365,000 in chips, and all those white dice combined ended up multiplying my winnings by 27, and in total, I ended up winning $198,855,000 from a $30 million buy, and that is absolutely exceptional. That's another huge life-changing profit right there absolutely mind-blowing and on top of that we won 78 ounces of gold and all those gold dice combined ended up multiplying the gold by 13 and in total I ended up winning 1,014 ounces of gold today and those are around $1,950 a piece and last but not least we got two bitcoins so that's two entries into the free $100,000 buy-in giveaway so that's not bad, not bad at all for a $30 million buy-in. So if y'all enjoyed today's video, be sure you leave a like and subscribe. Turn on those post notifications, that way you get notified for whenever I upload a new video. I will see y'all on the next one. Y'all take care and have an awesome day.